If your vehicle is equipped with a power lift gate, you'll find the power door main on off switch on the instrument panel. When this switch is in the off position, the lift gate switch and the opener switch on the lift gate will not operate. To operate the power lift gate, your shift lever must be in park. When the switch is in the on position, the lift gate can be opened in three ways by pressing the power lift gate switch on the instrument panel, by pushing the opener switch under the trim panel on the lift gate, or by pressing the power lift gate button on the intelligent key for more than one second. With each method, the hazard lights will flash and a chime will sound. The lift gate will open even if your doors are locked, if you use the main switch on the instrument panel or the button on the intelligent key. Your lift gate will also close automatically using the switch on the instrument panel, the intelligent key, or the power lift gate switch on the inside of the lift gate. With each method, the hazard lights flash and a chime sounds. If the power lift gate is in motion and the lift gate switch on the lift gate, instrument panel, or the intelligent key is pressed, the lift gate will immediately reverse direction. If your vehicle is equipped with a manual lift gate, you must first unlock the vehicle in order to open the lift gate. You'll find the opener switch just above the license plate under this trim panel. To open, push the switch while pulling up on the lift gate. To close, lower and gently push the lift gate down until it latches. If your battery is discharged and the lift gate cannot be locked or unlocked by the intelligent key or the door lock switch, remove this cover at the bottom of the lift gate. Beneath the cover is a lever. Move it up to unlock and open the lift gate. Move it down to lock in place. Do not drive with the lift gate open. Always check to make sure it has closed completely to prevent it from accidentally opening while on the road. Please see your owner's manual for important safety information, system limitations, and additional operating information.